I ask wise angels to guide me always to use this deck for the greatest good to others with insights, wisdom, compassion, genuine authenticity, and the truths. I'm getting comfortable. I'm tapping into our energy. Virgo, this is for the sign of Virgo. Don't mind the dogs. They'll shut up. Eventually, I hope. Hi guys, welcome to Safe Space. Let's go ahead and get into this reading. Today's energy. Oh, Virgo. I love ya. I love ya. I love ya. It is all, I too am a Virgo. I'm a Virgo son. Um, a lot of this, hey! A lot of this having to be, <laughs> as the hermit comes out, I'm getting this like energy of superhero saving the day saving everybody when it comes to time when we're so rooted and grounded in ourself you know somehow we attract so many in our life and our first instinct what maybe what our fight or flight is telling us is to react wholesomely wholeheartedly what can i do for you what service can i do for you <laughs> um here we go again uh waking up and having to go down the list really let's go ahead and take deep breaths virgo i'm excited for this reading Deep breaths as I shuffle these cards. As these cards come out. Doo -doo -doo. I have the Four of Cups. Um, I think it came out. Okay, Ten of Cups along with the Ten of Cups. And what came out together. And right here I have the Knight of Wands along with the Eight of Wands. So many things, like I said, and having to get rooted and get grounded with ourself and how much we are also um receiving and manifesting and then the knight of wands along with the eight of wands the passion also that's coming out a lot of that heavy emphasis on passion um reigniting the light reigniting the fire getting more into having to be more passionate and appreciating that side of us virgo whoops let's go ahead and get this overall energy story of this reading it may seem all so lonely and what feels lonely and what feels upsetting and disappointing and what feels upsetting, dissatisfying. Um, this side of us, I think we're having to go back. We have this like ability to see different things at a different angle, perspective, take this as it resonates. This is what's coming out and having to assist also ourself this big task that we have to uphold this certain kind of image that we also have to uphold um most importantly i mean this is what we stand in mostly or i feel what we come back to mostly you know we're uh bright and thriving well in our own space and it's what we come back to our ultimate source of having to understand our inner worlds and coming back out with insights wisdom um this is what we also thrive off of 
Virgo, our insights, the wisdom we pick up, and also having to experience the here and now and how much we get from that and things just kind of unfold in the way it does. It's kind of like a show, like a big theatrical show that um, faces you, you know, when things just so happens to align in the time that it does. And it always does, Virgo, because when our heart is in the right place, so much more. And I guess how you, however you want to resonate with it, this is what the messages are coming up. Um, and how much we are also taking in around this time because our heart is in the right place. It just so happens to be our favorite season. <laughs> Some affirmation also that I had pulled out. I am awake. I am awake. I am aware. I flow like water. I feel this energy absolutely right now. Oh, this overwhelming overwhelming thoughts nine of swords bottom of the deck overwhelming thoughts of like even the good to you're so cute virgo it's like even the good even the love is overwhelming i love so much and i do so many things and i so I do so many great things for everybody and, and for me also it just isn't enough virgo four of cups there's always this sense of like this just tinge of sadness that comes with everything. <laughs> and it just so happens and I think that what may feel so overwhelming is that it's because you're just so awake and so aware. Much like what this card is saying, you're flowing like water, you're flowing like everything is just going your way. I love that and it should, as it should Virgo and you deserve it. My brain is an engine of evolution. And as you go through this, having to be in a, a place of infinite awareness, you're just like, ah, oh, so many things are coming at me. What do I do? You give, you give, you give, you give, you give, you heal, you heal, you heal. Take, taking your gifts, your blessings, very precious and so close to yourself that I cannot help but to share it with the world. And so, as you do, I am the source of magic in my life. Exactly. Huh? And how much you are bringing, first of all, and having to appreciate yourself, giving thanks, honoring your body. It's as simple as you also having to go outside, watering your plants, giving things to nature, giving things to everybody around you, your family members friends and although sometimes it may seem a little distant you may seem a little distant from everything and everyone take this as it resonates virgo as distant as you can be as cold as you can be i think i'm, I'm picking a lot more on on distance right now as distant as you can be because heavy 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 energy on this nine of swords of uh so overwhelmed. <laughs> this is what I'm getting here. You're making also, you're finding the good in this also, and you're also finding the joy in these also. Positive attitude. Making yourself come to a stop. So overwhelmed. I need to pause. Virgo, do that. Very important. Very, very important. I love that. Thank you. You can center yourself at will, absolutely. Center yourself at will. This will, I suppose, um, help make things come to awareness as clear. Um, speak your intentions, starting with I desire so and so and so, I desire so and so and so, and having to speak and coming from a very pure intention, coming from a place of intentions and mostly being more efficient, okay? Because <laughs> this is something that I feel Virgos do. We have to be efficient as soon as we wake up, uh, keeping things in order. 
things like that. Having to keep yourself at center. Exactly, you can center yourself at will. Taking on, okay, there, there must, there might be what you having to be taking on at this time, Virgo. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep going. I, I love this flow right now. Um, even though you are eh, a little out of order and what feels overwhelming to you, you're, what you're doing with this and having to channel all of these emotions, you're just having to like do what you love, man. Investing, creating, building, rebuilding, learning, reading. I love it. Immersing yourself in all of these things. Staying a positive, staying in a positive attitude is what I'm getting here, Virgo. I love this energy so much. And thank you for letting me do this reading. I hope you guys are having an amazing season. Um, deep breaths. I desire, speak your intentions and just immersing in a place where you feel comfort. Always take care, Virgo. I love you guys so much. Bye.